Hey guys, welcome to day 200. That's right, we now rolled into the 200s of my carnivore journey. So we have 10 more days until we do a weigh-in. Now, I don't expect to lose a whole lot. I felt like I've pretty much sort of stalled. I, I don't know. I mean, we'll, we'll just find out. I've been talking about stalling for a while now, but that's also because I've been eating... I have been pushing myself to eat as strict as, as far as you guys have seen. Like I kind of went back to having like a carnivore pizza recently, a couple nights of, of keto, so to speak. Um, you know, I've had some, probably some more pork rinds than I have in the past. Um, maybe some more cheese again here and there. So, yeah, I mean, there's some things that I, I, I need to tighten up on um, and I plan on it. So, but tonight or today, I had a couple hot dogs and I had some pork rinds and I had for dinner, I had steak and eggs. So I want to get back to not just having steak, but I would like to start getting some eggs back into my diet more often because I know that they are also full of nutrients, especially in the yolks. So I made, I made three over medium eggs with the steak. And of course I didn't picture the eggs in the steak because you know, the eggs don't look as pretty, <laughs> but that's what I had. So as far as feeling wise goes, um, it, it's been kind of off and on. I mean, on average, I feel pretty good. You know, um, most days I've got, I've got energy when I need it. I can breathe. I don't have a lot of stomach issues, not a lot of, um, you know, using the restroom too much. Um, I've had kind of some days where I've been a little more regular lately with using the restroom each day, but it hasn't been diarrhea. It hasn't been, you know, constipation. It's been, you know, right where it needs to be. So that tells me good things. Uh, so, and you don't have to be regular again. It's just that because I've been eating some of these additional type things like pork rinds and hot dogs and stuff like that, that's going to give me a little more, regular now if i start getting strictly back to steaks and eggs then you'll probably see less bathroom breaks and things like that also um the only thing i want to cover tonight with some of you guys is just after 200 days of carnivore i want to keep going you know i do this is something i don't want to give up on um I just feel like it's such a good life and I feel so much better as an individual. Uh, I know it's going to take time. Uh, like Dr. Barry said, vitamin P for patients, right? Um, I've got it to stay patient just because I am coming up on, on, uh, on the nine month mark soon or whatnot, or wait, what am I, um, what would it be? 37 uh, months coming up. 90 is what I'm trying to get to. But this is coming up on my seven month mark. And, you know, obviously I didn't get out of shape in seven months, <laughs> you know, or even a year. So it's going to take some time and little by little. So I look forward to it. I, um, I guess I think it's Father's Day weekend this weekend. I think my son's coming over um, tomorrow and Saturday. So I'll have him for a few days and um, I'm thinking about uh, going out to the tennis court with him and have him uh, hit some balls at me. And, you know, I'm just going to try to, he's really good. So <laughs> I, there's no way I'm going to be able to play with him at all, but I think I'm at least going to get out there and have him, have him, you know, feed me some balls and maybe get a little bit of exercise like that. Um, so I plan on doing a little bit of, um, some activity this weekend, not a whole lot to be honest with you, but, but either way, I'm excited. That's about all I really have for you guys. Just kind of a quick update day 200 feeling good, eating good. You guys are still trickling in some comments. I see that you guys have gone over and you guys have been giving my roommate some support. And I really appreciate that. Like I said, guys, you know, he really needs the help. His link is down below. Um, but yeah, giving him advice, helping him out, it's going to help him get through. Uh, I know you guys helped me through, and I hope I've helped some of you guys through. So it's a two-way street for sure. 
But guys, I love you, and I will see you guys. Um, to, I hope I hopefully tomorrow. I'm gonna try. I I can't promise you another update tomorrow with having my son here, and I gotta work tomorrow. But we'll see. I'm gonna try. I've been trying to do daily, but yesterday was busy again. And now that we're starting to get into film season, uh, and just things like that, just life's been like even more hectic here lately. So, but we'll see you guys soon. Bye.